Morgan. What's that, Nate? <laughs> update here right after this hole but I can't quite remember so this was a oh wow tasty one right through that bush fist pump had to run it in doesn't get this was like two inches outside the circle so I, that kind of fires me up because I'm like oh sweet I can steal a circle too here oh yeah look at it. and the slow mess yeah because then I know if I make this sweet I gotta go straight over this oh, wow. tell me what you think of this one little t-bird three Oh, just fighting the wind the whole time. It's looking pretty good, Nate. It's looking pretty good. And it curls up left. Well, not, I think not a lot of spots better than that. Love, and here we are. All the marbles on the line right here. Yeah, to get in that tie. Oh, what a fantastic putt. I was so happy into that headwind. For a while, I kind of thought, this putt's impossible. I'm almost <laughs> certainly going to throw it in the waterfall. Look at in. that emotion. I couldn't believe I love it. Yeah! Out to the left. Yeah, you get your Sexton Firebird out and you just ask it to do one. Oh, okay. Look at the bricks. Now let me ask you, was there a big gash on your desk? It was okay this time. <laughs> wow. Yeah. There goes Nate after it. He's in a pretty tough spot here. Oh, forehand roller. Perfect line. Remember, Germ has to wait for that disc to come to rest. I didn't have time to look at my follow through idea. Yeah. Right through all. And as soon as he put his foot down, <laughs> yeah. perfect angle. How do you even control the angle that way? Yeah, right under the basket, but it looked like it had a chance out of the hand. It was right on that line. Trusting a straight disc. What are you throwing here? I'm throwing a flip ear destroyer. Okay. And just under the basket. Yeah. Do this is more of the par. Be ring it up Are you from ready? about 45 feet into about a 40 mile an hour wind. That's Probably one of the best putts of my career, to be honest. Man, That's hair care. Here I am from quite some distance. Oh, that just continues to flatten up. That is a bomb shot there. Oh my goodness, and you've skipped inside and you are, oh my gosh. What a save there. You yeah, are that way. Yeah, give me some slow mess. Yeah, I had to get that one uh, after the bad break with the light ball. I even, I even went right up to Joe Mez. I said, don't worry, man, I'm going to make the fuck. That's the working man's three there. Incredible. Yeah, happy to get it. I got to thank Ricky Wysocki. I've I was ever there. seen on this hole. It is so tricky to keep this in the parameters of the fairway without going too wide. Minimal left to right spin. Perfect skip across the ditch to a tap in. Don't hit your head. I was happy, man. I kept it really, really straight. I will settle for a par and eight with a circle's edge. That's good. a good putt. Mm -hmm. That's a great putt. I mean, at this point, 16, good you, gotta, right you almost have to run it. It's like the layup is the uh, test yeah. is Maybe I'll hit metal and just have it stop. Nate! Great putt. He was so disappointed with that roll. Again, he like... Had, you know, something terrible happens and he overcomes it. I was just about that. And then Macbeth, before the round, was like, hey, you're just, first in putting. Yeah, way to psych him out, Paul. <laughs> <laughs> and then Nate, not one to get big putted by an 18 year old. The trees in a fair way, it's difficult to just count on it. Mm -hmm. It's kind of fun. We got two trilogy team members and two, like, Innova team members. You know? Oh, yeah, that's true, huh? And the the Innova family. The spotter said there was three threes total leading up to this card. Really? Mm -hmm. 
There's four. There's four threes. Great putt, Nate. Out of his hand, he's like, nope. Nope. See that one more time. This is my Excalibur. Out around the outside. Keep it low. Try to get a big skip. Just make sure you get closer than Paul. <laughs> Good job, man. I mean, just go ahead and hit metal. If you're going to get that close, just get a little bit of that yeah. tink tink. I'll take that, man. That was on the line. Sexton, a little bit obstructed here. Bang. Ooh. I like that one. I mean, he's got a straddle. All right. Back. Were you thinking about it at all, honestly? Like, oh, as soon as he made it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Nate says, I will not be out. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> little putting display going on here. I love the calculations that you, you do on your putt before, you know? Oh, yeah. Like reading the green in golf, right? Yeah, you kind of have to. Whoa, that was sick. Wow. Was nice putt from Sexton. Well done, Nate. If you're going to have a 30 footer. Yeah. Definitely something Kevin can knock down. Mm -hmm. Sexton, go and start a Destroyer again. He said it was five feet like, out the I last like time we played line. this hole. I like this line a lot. Hang it. Stay out of there. <laughs> what a shot. What a shot. He's stoked. Yes. He's like, I think he's just more in his head than anything else at this point. Mm -hmm. uh, Ricky, Ricky plays to win. And I think he, he's feeling it slip out of his hands. And, he, it, and it's, it's cognitive of it. Ooh. Good putt from Nate there. What a par save. save it. Ricky plays Ricky Bobby disc golf. If you're not first, you're last. <laughs> just low. You Maybe know. a little adjustment from the last couple that he missed high. Oh, true. Just an over adjustment. Sexton with a long look at it, too. Nice. And notice, I think he's probably outside the circle there. Yeah, that's the play. In years past, they've always called that tree's friend of the players, but I, I didn't know that it was just that friendly. That's that's two very, very fortunate tree kicks for both Drew and for Beth. And Nate was, he was, he was He's, online to hit that same tree, but. Yeah. But I've also, I've also heard him say before, he's not from the trees. No. Just, in fact, he calls them by the wrong name all the time. Did you know that? Yes. <laughs> On purpose, too. Oh, Besides yeah, Studios. Because never... he just kind of hit a putt of a similar length that I, I feel like. Ooh. Great hit, Nate. Maybe the wind. We gotta, let's check out this distance real quick. Just outside the circle, Sexton. but just inside the basket. Nicely done, sir. Oh, he's he's going Barsby mode on that jump, but yeah, that's pretty nice. You're gonna get a straight skip. Yep. If you don't have a overly exaggerated highs highs right. Look at that birdie from Sexton. Yeah. Nice putt. Yeah, good commitment on the follow through. It's downhill, but uh, yeah, these guys are definitely looking to birdie this hole. If if you have if you have the controllable just I guess we'll call it like a crunch hyzer, like this is a this is a very attackable hole. Yeah. And if you do miss, it's a pretty easy three. Now yeah. the, the only thing that you can do is find OB, have to go to the drop zone. That's perfect. And oh, wow, done. He's throwing that orange just really well. I'm lining up an enforcer side, I'm in this pretty pretty comfortable comfortably because I can just hammer on it and trust that it's gonna get there and uh, find the island. And if not, you know, if you miss, you should still be able to take a bogey here. You know, right. if you go to the drop zone, you say, all right, I'll lay it up, take a four, go to the next hole. It's not killing you. It doesn't kill your round. It doesn't hurt you. Sit down. Sit down for the man. That's beautiful. Okay. Okay. Right. Yeah. We got 140 feet. We got a little distance ticker. What's that about? Just trying to play the game. Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Two and four holes? Was that a Mako 3? It was. Mako 3. Oh, look at that. That is what the fans came here for. And that's your tournament play, correct? Correct me if I'm wrong. Rip a Mako 3 at the pin. Yeah. Yeah, I do that every year. <laughs> Got my Mako 3. Oh. You did say that. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, geez, that's wrong, buddy. <laughs> that is wrong. Look at you throw-ins on hole four and on I-5. This is clearly not going in. Clearly not going in. Oh, uh, good mock catch. X. Good catch. Mock X grabs. Oh, that's such a beautiful shot with the gallery behind any other year. Yeah, and it's showing. And what do you see? I had to put kind of real, like a high little spin. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. Got a piece of a tree. 
spot Thanks. on through. Look at the focus. You didn't even blink, dude. <laughs> Don't have time. But it wasn't enough to stop it. Canada too? Oh yeah. Are you serious? Had to be a hyzer. I couldn't see how, that much the basket. I had to do a little bit of lean here to get wow. it to get around. Well, I wish I could say there wasn't a flood on that butt, but I'd be lying. Oh, it there needed was, flood. There's about 12 <laughs> floods. Oh, man. Oh, look at that flux. <laughs> there's four total rotations on the disc in, in about 40 feet. 27 feet. I'm going with Firebird. Juicing up a little bit. We saw you go long in round one with the X Cal. This time you're not long. Not long. And deserving of a nice follow flight. Look at this thing bend perfectly. Hit the grass. Thick grass in this hole. It's kind of hard to imagine how a disc could settle up in that. God, this is a 50 footer for par. Where Kevin got his first part of the round in round two. And look at you. <laughs> I'm getting up near that band. Keep this up, man. Look at how much this misses the band. Hey, he hits it. <laughs> That's getting awesome. him up in the air. Oh, the triumphant fist pump. Firebird ready to go. All revved up. Go in. Oh, my gosh. Nearly. Oh man, that was sweet. You hear that car revved up, the Firebird's revved up. No! So close. If you'd just taken a little bit more advice from the putting game, yeah. just a little bit a little higher. higher. I've got this for Birdie. This, yeah, all right. I've been joining in these elite clubs. This is one Birdie of only seven on the day. Nice. Going for and crafty is exactly the right word for this card. They are pulling out all the stops. This is a beautiful angle for Sexton and tracking those rocks. Come on. <laughs> He's as a fly the best. Sexton with the smooth forehand as, as Sexton is wont to do. Oh wow. He is just he, oh my goodness. Sorry, that I said smooth, huge. but I meant crushed for his yeah. shot. That's what. That's another thing that makes it feel a lot longer than it is. Huge putt there for Nate. Notice he's on the down slope, which means he's probably a little, He's he could be lower, which also means he's going to be a little bit higher and probably closer to level with the basket. That's right. Now, if you got this shot, just go ahead and throw that. That's wow. a... And a perfect little straddle putt there, dead center. Tricky stance from there. But I believe you're going with a Thunderbird roller here. Yeah, I'm looking to get aggressive here. And Thunderbird roller is an, a very aggressive play because it's such an overstable disc that it wants to hold this cut to the left. And that's going to give you that extra distance. And you, <laughs> this thing is spinning so slow, you can read the stamp almost. <laughs> but it just wants to keep going, keep going. Look at that extra distance and then stops like that. I mean, and that was one. That's a grunted putt there from. Yeah. You don't really see you grunt much when you putt, but you yeah. had to really get that nose up and push through that. The low ceiling. I needed a lot of spin. I was really, really happy to get that high enough from from that line. And uh, with the the recovery par save on four, and then the birdie on five. It's a great turnaround for him. And nice. such a technical shot to be able to throw left of that tree, right and high of the other tree behind it. I was feeling big pressure here to commit to this shot. I kind of wanted Ricky, if Ricky hadn't thrown it that well, I was going to go wide hyzer and lay up for three. But I was able to execute and I really felt proud of myself for throwing that shot as hard as I needed to. And <laughs> you not. and Ricky make it look. <laughs> I just aim at the very left side of the structure and try to throw hard hyzer low. And look at this straight Danny skip just outside the bullseye. Is that in the bullseye? I think it might have been. We'll, yeah. get, we'll get to know here on the follow flight. Sneak, sneak, sneak. Oh yeah. Bullseye. Bullseye. What a shot. That much. 
Here I am from about 25, 28 feet. And this is a nerve testing putt here, and there's just... finish he is back with a, a top fiver and there it is i couldn't believe it hugs all around you know some of my best friends here to watch my wife and baby right there trying to get my attention <laughs> you're just, you're just lost. i didn't know where i was then i found him oh, this and, is great yeah man i still can't really believe it i uh something i've i've always wanted to do for sure in a big one